I'm Jessica, and today I want to talk about how many mob variants there are in Minecraft. Now this video is inspired by the recent update. 1.13 was just released, and if you haven't heard of the tropical fish, well, there are a lot of them. The addition of tropical fish in all their different colors means there are thousands of new mob variants in the game, but how many are there in total? That's what I want to calculate today, so prepare for a lot of math. Before I start the calculations though, let's be clear on what counts as a variant. For the purpose of this video, I'm talking about Minecraft 1.13 on the Java Edition. I'm only going to count variations that make a significant change to the skin and or behavior of the mob. A variant is more of a permanent trait than a temporary condition or an added detail, so I will not count things like hostile vexes, armored zombies, or potion effects. I'm also only going to count mob variants obtainable in survival vanilla Minecraft without cheats. So mobs like the zombie horse or the killer bunny will also not be included. If you disagree with me on what I should count as a variant, or if you notice a mistake in this video, please let me know in the comments. Now, let's get started. Here I have lined up pretty much all of the quote-unquote base mobs we will be using for our calculations. Let's do them one by one. The mobs that have no variations in survival have a red terracotta block above them. Those include the iron golem, the snow golem, the blaze, the salmon, the pufferfish, the cod, the endermite, the elder guardian, the shulker, the phantom, the dolphin, here he is, the bat, the cave spider, the enderman, the evoker, the ghast, the guardian, the mule, the silverfish, the skeleton, the skeleton horse, the spider, the squid, the stray, the vex, the Vindicator, the Witch, and the Wither Skeleton. That's a total of 28 mobs if I've counted correctly, plus the Ender Dragon and the Wither for a total of 30. We'll add those in at the end. Now let's do all the rest. Here are all the mobs with baby variations, but no others. Turtle, Drowned, Chicken, Cow, Donkey, Husk, Mushroom, Pig, Polar Bear, Zombie, and Zombie Pigman. Therefore, each of those mobs counts for two variations. There are 11 of them, so that's 22 more. The Creeper has a charged variation, so add two more for the Creeper. Slimes and Magma Cubes have three sizes each, so that's a total of six more. Then there's the Horse. I didn't know this before, but horses have seven base colors they can spawn with, and then they have five patterns that can be added on top of that. Here are the seven base colors of Horse, and I believe we have all five five patterns here as well. A couple of our duplicates, of course. And since 7 times 5 is 35, that means that there are 35 total possible horse variations. But wait, there's more. There is also the baby horse, of course, which means that each variation also has a baby form, so that's 35 times 2, which is 70 total horse variations. Then, of course, we have the llamas. There are four possible colors of llama, but then, of course, there's also the babies, so that's eight total possible llama variations. Then we have the ocelot. For the ocelot, there's a baby and then three types of cat, each with a baby as well, so that's four total adult ocelot-type mobs and four babies for a grand total of eight ocelot variations. There's also five types of parrot. There are six naturally spawning types of rabbit, but there's also the toast rabbit, which is different from the default black and white rabbit, so that's seven rabbit variations but then there's also rabbit babies, so that's a total of 14 rabbits. There are 16 sheep colors, so with babies, that's 32. Then there's the wolf variations. You can have a wild wolf or a tamed wolf, aka a dog, and then you can also breed your dogs into puppies, so that's three variations for the wolf. Villagers can have six different professions, which you can see from the color of their robes. With baby villagers, that's 12 villager variations. I've chosen not to include the specific careers, such as Fletcher or Shepherd, because those don't affect the villagers' appearance. Zombie villagers thus also have six careers, and with baby zombie villagers, that's also a total of 12. And now, time for some addition. If you want to follow along with me on a calculator, feel free. 30 mobs with no variants, plus 22 mobs with just baby variations, plus 2 creepers, plus 6 slimes and magma cubes, plus 70 horses, plus 8 llamas, plus 8 ocelots, plus 5 parrots, plus 14 rabbits, plus 32 sheep, plus 3 wolves, 12 villagers, and 12 zombie villagers adds up to a heck of a gigantic zoo. In all seriousness, though, that's a total of 224 mob variations obtainable in survival. Now, some of you might think we're done, but if you remember what I said at the beginning of the video, you'll know we're not quite there, because I saved the tropical fish for last. Now, according to the Minecraft wiki, there are 2,700 different types of tropical fish that spawn naturally in Minecraft. So 2,700 plus 224 brings us to our final total of 2,924 mob variants in Minecraft. The tropical fish alone multiplied our total by 13, and I think that's just crazy. But there you go. There are 2,924 mob variations in Minecraft. Please let me know if you think I made a mistake somewhere, but otherwise, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching. Bye!